All right, coming up next, it's a UFC heavyweight showdown. All right, so here's the former UFC welterweight champion. They also call him the chosen one, Tyron Woodley. Knocked out Robbie Lawler in 2016 to first win the belt, held it for several years, and still has the credentials as one of the best 170-pound fighters on this roster. A-plus athlete is Tyron Woodley, a guy that can explode into his strikes and into his takedowns like no one we've ever seen before. The way that he backpedaled and then knocked out Jay Heron was unbelievable. The way that he just flatlined Josh Koscheck was crazy. He has a right hand that you do not want to be on the receiving end of. Tyron Woodley is truly a special, special fighter. He has had some issues injury-wise with that right hand. He told us before the fight, 100% coming in tonight. When you punch that hard, John, right. you're going to have some problems with the right hand. I cannot speak to that, but I will <laughs> take your word for it. John's got power. A little power. All right, well, he's one of the more accomplished strikers in this division. Sprawl and brawl, whatever you want to say, he's going to try to keep this fight standing tonight. It does not matter how he accomplishes it. All he wants to do is be on his feet and at range, hitting you with the beautiful jab, staying away from the grappling exchanges. You don't accomplish all the things that this man has accomplished over the course of his career without understanding distance. He has great distance management, which then in turn allows him to land all these beautiful diverse kicks, spinning back kick, jumping high kick, so many things he possesses that he will try to use tonight in this fight. Yeah, if this turns into a kickboxing match tonight, most it's people over. believe, yeah, his opponent is in a it's world over, of trouble. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight, more than five years apart, with big differences in height, but some differences in reach. We set it inside the octagon, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, a referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the Honda Center in Anaheim, California. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 19 wins, 7 losses, and 1 draw. He stands 5 feet 9 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of St. Louis, Missouri, USA, Tyron, the chosen one, Woodley. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet five inches tall, weighing in at 265 pounds. Assassin. Okay, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. Big knee to the body. And a nice 
Nice job at least staying upright on that. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Oh, nice connection with that punch. It's one thing to have an edge in reach. It's another to take advantage. Nicely done. Oh, and he can't, oh, can't do that in soccer, but it's allowed here. Nice trip to get the takedown. Oh, great foot sweep right there. Got to the clinch, started manipulating the body, and the moment his opponent took a misstep, boom, tripped him right over the top. Great job. All right, good movement by him here on the ground. He really is a master of these transitions. He is a master of movement on the ground. You never know where he's going to be. All right, north-south position here. We'll see if the crowd can be mature about this, DC. Oh, and there's the horn at the end of the round. So the fighter was really caught in a submission there just as the horn sounded. Safe to say he was saved by the bell there. So back to the stools they go. 60 seconds to recover here. We're going to fight on, ladies and gentlemen. Another round coming up. All right, so there is the horn at times in that previous round. I didn't think we'd get here after that head kick nearly had him out of there. It was a good round leading up to that. But when you take a head kick like that, when your opponent gets your entire body into that kick, usually the night's over. Very tough to still be standing, but he can't take many more like that. All right, round two. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Well, T. Wood's been waiting for an opportunity to set up that right hand. Set it up beautifully there. Eight foot double leg shot. Oh, nice slam as he gets into the canvas. Exactly what he needed. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. Look at how he turns his hip. Oh, he got him real good, too. And both guys really throwing with authority. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Now, DC. Oh man, he was in a single, got to a high crotch. Oh. Nice big takedown. What a technique, what a takedown. Great high impact skill. You could feel the canvas reverberating here. I mean, it's right there. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> it's like me running anywhere, John. <laughs> That's right. Well, a real. Oh! Who's hurt? Serve him up. We'll get oh, him. he might be out. Big right hand lands. You got him. If I'm gonna do this to anybody, it's Eddie. And he landed the right hand there. And he comes through with a big knee. What a fight so far! All right, so a big knockdown in that last round. DC will show you the replay. Nearly had him out of there. He almost had him out. He had him gone. He hurt him real bad. He thought the fight was over. But the night will go on. The dance continues. Will this be the final dance? Third round underway. An elbow! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Yeah, that right there is a high-level knockout, ladies and gentlemen. Crowd absolutely loving it. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Landed flush. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming. So a huge, huge win for that young fighter here tonight. So there he is as the celebration continues. A huge knockout for him here tonight. That could hold up as one of the better knockouts of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve LeBing has called a stop to this contest at 20 seconds of round number three. Declaring the winner by knockout, Assassin!
Yeah. 